Hey everybody, guess what? We're live for lunchtime hour. We've got the next door boys. This is the first time I've had six people in total on the screen. This is pretty amazing. And actually we've really got seven because Ethan was having a little bit of trouble connecting with us. And so you can see a little FaceTime there. See, he's waving at us. I love that. So the next door boys, Matthew, tell us how you guys came up with the name, the next door boys. We originally came up with the name Next Door Boys when we originally formed the band using the app Next Door. We were all close by each other, and we were all boys, so we decided to add that onto the name. And I that's love it. So that Next Door app where people are like, "Hey, you want to buy this or pick this up for free?" You actually put together the whole band through that app. Yes. We did. Wow. Who came together first? Was it all of you, or how did that happen? It was originally uh, I when I started the band. I originally put out the post. And Joe and Miles were the first two in the band. Uh, and we all have been in the band originally for three years now. So the whole way. Then we had um, Kai come in. And he was our new bass player. And we had Ethan come in for our new vocalist. And then we had Kyle after because Kai left and Kyle came back. And then we had Kai come back to bass. And Kyle is now a uh, rhythm guitar player. Ah, Kyle, what made you want to leave and come back like that, man? Yeah, for real, Kyle. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, it's Kai. <laughs> oh, Kai. Kai's the one who came and left, come back, or Kyle? Kai. Kai. Came Kai. Back. Oh, Kai. Sorry. Sorry. Kai, what made you want to do that? Uh, I just had a lot of stuff going on, and I had some, uh, I don't know, there's some, like, problems with the last vocalist that I didn't really like that much. And then uh, this vocalist came and I liked him a lot. So then I came back when he came too. I see. So we had a little couple band problems like most people encounter, right? Right. right. Yeah. All right. Well, tell us what kind of music you guys play in case people haven't heard you. Um, We play like mainly rock music, rock covers, but we're trying to add more originals in. Sounds good. And then recently you had a performance in Nolansville. Tell us about that. Yeah, we had, um, we did it at Wheeler's Raid in Nolansville. And that was actually the first time we played live uh, at a venue in since like March, April maybe, or probably, probably March. Yeah. yeah. Are you excited to do that? Yeah. You know, let's talk about talking about performances. You guys had a missed performance, not once, but twice. City of Brentwood, you won the contest to play at the Crockett Park. Your first performance got canceled due to rain, and then they rescheduled you, and then what happened? They canceled us. <laughs> because I think there was another rain. We had a lot of rain last summer. Right. Tell us about uh, applying for that contest and how that worked. Well, we originally saw the uh, contest on a fi on Facebook, and we decided to contact them and try and sign up. And we went to the contest, and it turned out actually a pretty good crowd. Uh, had a nice time, fun time, and um, we won and had a good time. So we we're excited and getting a mentality for the next gig at a bigger venue, City of Brentwood. And we got there, and uh, I think it was maybe an hour later. They finally decided to cancel it because all of the trees were starting to get really bent over and the rain was heavy and the wind was heavy. So everything was starting to fly away and we just, they couldn't do it. So they had to cancel us. Right. Well, that's unfortunate, but pretty impressive that you guys actually won, right? Mm -hmm. right. Um, tell us about, you guys have some uh, covers, but you also have original music, original song. Tell me about that. So right now we have two originals that we're working on. Um, one of them's um, like we're pretty close to getting out. One of them we're going to record soon, but yeah. And so um, there's an acoustic version of this that Miles, you're gonna perform for us. Tell us about that. Cause you did a whole thing with the acoustic version of this. Yeah, so it was like this thing called the Acoustic Guitar Project where uh, you get a guitar for a week and you write a song in that week. So I wrote this song. 
Um, and then we performed at the Country Music Hall of Fame and then brought it to the band and we rocked it up, changed it up a little bit. Rock. So since we can't all be together, you guys can't all be together right now. Um, Miles, you're gonna give us that song in a yeah. music version? Like a little like snippet, so like a version of the chorus. And I'm not like a singer like Ethan. So it's <laughs> really as good as, as Ethan singing. That's yeah. all right. Ethan's giving you a thumbs up, right? Yeah, I'll, I'll make sure that it don't pass it. <laughs> All right, Miles, let's hear it. That was great. I love it. Tell me, tell everybody where they can find out. When's your next gig going to be? Currently, we are scheduling gigs and booking gigs, but if you want to find out about our gig dates or even get email updates, uh, you can you can find us at, at Nextra Boys on Instagram, uh, Facebook, and you can go to our website, nextdoorboysrock.com. Okay, and then you're going to have new music out, I heard, right? Miles was just telling you, when is that going to be out? Uh, we are currently almost finished with the first song, and we should have it out by the end of June. All right, sounds great. You guys go follow them. You guys all, so do you all, all live close together? I know you were in the Next Door app, so you live close by? Yeah, we live close by. Relatively close. Yeah relatively close all right yeah. we can't wait to hear more hopefully we'll get to see you in person soon and you guys take care we'll see you soon thank you, thank take you. Care. Bye. bye everybody bye, bye. ethan bye.